What is going on guys? Kittymon here. Welcome back to another Terraria video. Today, oh, well, not today. I mean, I'll get to that eventually. However, in the last video, <laughs> we ended up going to the underworld and getting ourselves some molten armor and molten weapons, which will help us in some of the up and coming boss fights that we are going to try and do today. Uh, first boss fight that we're doing, we are going to head over to the dungeon and try and kill Skeletron because we've been struggling with him. We've tried to do him, I think, twice. And uh, yeah, it's been, it's been kind of a struggle. So we're pretty much going to do the same thing. We're going to have some potions. Um, we're going to do archery potion. Uh... Iron skin potion. Uh, toss on one of those. Grab a lemon, because why not? What was the potion that uses cactus? I don't remember. Regen potion. Um, we're going to pull out all the stops. Mobs drop. Need a lens. Go over here to our crafting bench. Regen potion. Archery potion. Swiftness and iron skin. Iron skin, we need lead. We need... We have those. I'm missing a dandelion. No. Um... Frick. Oh, there's one. Easy dubs. Just kidding. Where can I find myself a dandelion? We'll find it on the way. <laughs> swiftness potion. They need a swiftness potion too. Oh, come on. On the lookout for a dandelion somewhere. We aren't going to be able to find it in this biome. <laughs> dude i love this new sword that we got it's just so powerful and it's like any hit that you hit something with it's it's gonna be a decent amount of damage so it's gonna be pretty freaking good plus the sound that it makes is the same sound that the uh I think it's called a solar flare. It's a snake sword. I think it's the only snake sword in the game, which is actually amazing. Um, you get that after beating the game. So, I mean, that only makes sense, but I love that sword. And like every collision it makes, it makes like that boom effect. So it's real satisfying. Maybe we'll get there someday. But for now, we're trying to kill Skeletron. Find some dandelions. Got the snow biome to deal with too. I just realized I'm not even wearing my shield. Oh god, that's gonna be annoying. Oh yeah, we also killed the goblin army in one of the... I, th I think it wasn't the last video, but it was a video before that. We ended up killing the goblin army, which is pretty cool. It also doubles as a light source, which is pretty good. Oh, wait, was that one down there? That might be one. It was not. Dang. As far as I see, I'm not seeing any down there. Do we just send it? I think we should just send it. We only have 16 fire arrows though. Oh, come on. That's kind of the whole spiel. We were going to use a bunch of fire arrows. Or hellfire arrows. Oh well. We'll still, we'll still deal a decent amount of damage. Hopefully we can beat it. But, uh... Can't make any promises, I guess, at this point. Um, Anik Necklace. Yeah. What 
throw the panic necklace on in place of the regen shield thing. I'll place this first. Quick buff. Curse. So, like the last time, our main goal is to break his hands first. Jeez. I say break his hands first, and I'm just going straight for his head. That panic necklace is coming in clutch. Yo. Taken a decent amount of damage so far, but I mean, I was gonna say that was kind of bad, but uh, we we kind of handled that well. Taking another hit. You can go sicko mode here in a sec. Man, I really gotta figure out my my strafes, what I'm doing. I did not mean to run into him like that. Come on, let me heal. Let me heal. I have 10 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. There's gonna be one hand down, I swear. Can I heal? Can I heal? Can I heal? Let me heal. Okay, I healed. Huh. <laughs> We can break that one hand. Should be all right. You know what? Okay, one hand down, one hand down. He's throwing homing skulls. That's his new attack for hard mode. I, I guess frick, frick. Those do a decent amount of damage too. Okay, okay. Focus the one hand. Heal when I can. Heal, heal, thank you. Okay, cool. I was like, I didn't heal. I didn't heal before. Oh man. This is totally gonna be it. This is totally gonna be it. Holy! Why is he throwing so many of them? And those things do a decent amount of damage too. What the heck? Okay, so I can break them though. The only thing is, I can only get hit like once or twice more. Come on! And we only got him down to half health? I think the problem was we weren't doing enough damage. I feel like we would have had him because I was launching so many arrows. Man. I feel like, okay, I wonder if, because I didn't know, it looked like I could break it. It really did look like I could break those, um, whatchamacallits, it looked like I could break those skulls. So I wonder if just going in with the sword, swing at them, because the sword's going to do a significant amount of damage, because this does 31, the sword does an instant 49 on top of burn damage. I know it, I know this does burn damage too, but... I mean, I have to hit a couple shots in a row before it actually does the burn damage, so I really don't know. Oh, we do have a dandelion. We have two of them. Thorn potion. Oh, that's what we should have used. We have two dandelions, but it's also turning daytime. Oh, man. I guess for now, I will go try and collect some more dandelions and then... I'll be back during nighttime again.
Yeah, but no, let me tell you, that panic necklace came in handy, dude. So, I mean, even though it looks like I'm going pretty slow, once I get hit, like, once, I'm just gone. Like, it is... It's pretty handy. I'm gonna say it might be even more handy than the shield that I don't have equipped at the moment. It's like, yeah. I mean, just look at this. Okay, not super stupid speedy, but... This dude's running away from me. What are you doing, man? Get over here. What? I was just expanding. What do you mean? <laughs> King Slime, alrighty. Free boss battle, let's go. Oh, what type of attack is that? Alrighty then, I guess we killed the king slime. What is this dude? We can pet that dude. Okay, cool. Either way, I still got a I still got a new new boss to, to spawn in. We're doing bosses today, I guess. Oh man. That is so wild. Just spawned out of nowhere. I've never seen him do that. Just like just casually spawns in. Like what? Alright, uh, almost. I'm just gonna finish this off. Come on. Oh my god. Wrong button or item, I should say. All of this prep work for one measly easy mode boss that's wild. Okay, so we're here. Um, bag of treasures. I wonder if this will help us out at all. Oh, yo, let's go. I don't know what button it is for my, for the mount. Crap. Um, settings, controls, mount, where's my mount? Mount is R. Okay, yeah, this, I mean, we don't get the, the speed effect though, which we kind of need, but I can spawn it in at will. Basically just allows us to jump higher. A lot higher. All right, gonna do quick buff, boom, spawn him in yet again. Here we are. Let me try and get all the way up to the top here. Oh my god, can I hit my shots? Yikes.
See, look at how much more damage these arrows are doing versus the other those other ones. Was my first heal. All right, so he got the arrows, or he's got those things. Okay. How do I do this? So I can't even like I got 19 more seconds before I can Let me heal Okay cool Like, what am I? Let me heal 19 seconds. I can't get hit by anything, otherwise I get that. Eh. <laughs> it What do you mean? My freaking sh Oh, dude. The, the freaking Oh, the panic necklace ran out right as soon as I was going in to swing for him. Come on. Bro. Why is this boss so difficult? Oh my god. I even need to heal right there. Did we even get a trophy for killing the Eye of Cthulhu? I have no clue. Either way, I think we'll just toss our trophies up in this room. Alrighty. So, um, I really don't feel like waiting around for it to be nighttime again. So, I think I'm going to end it here. Um, in the next video. Dude, I feel like we could do it. I really feel like we could do it. But, oh man. Yeah, I think we might, we might need more health. That's what we're going to do. We need more health. And so, yeah, I can think of a couple different better ways that we can go about this. Way number one is go into the underground, find the goblin tinker, and also get more health. Option number two is maybe get some more items in here, but I really think that we have enough to beat them. We just need more, I guess. So, yeah.
Man, I I threw. I threw in that end. I literally was going to go in and swing because it, it, literally you saw his health bar. Like I only needed to hit him with the sword maybe like twice, three times. But then the panic necklace ran out and I just was way too close to him for me to like actually be able to run away from him without taking damage. So, man, oh, well, I'll accept defeat again. Um, Yeah, next video. We'll either do jungle stuff or go grab some more health in the underworld. Not underworld. Not the underworld. Just, you know, go exploring some more. Do all that fun stuff. So I think that's what we'll probably end up doing in the next video is just go explore some stuff. Should be all right. Alrighty. So, um, yeah, that was tragic, but oh, well, we'll get them next time. Um, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. We, I mean, we, it wasn't all for naught. We, we ended up killing the slime king and also got a mount. So that's, that's pretty cool. Jumpy, jumpy mount. Let's go. So, uh, yeah, I'm actually curious how f high up this thing jumps. Dude, it goes like all the way up. What? Four stories almost three stories. That's crazy. But yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please feel free to share it with your friends. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. You know, all those fun YouTube things that people tell you to do. Join me next Tuesday for some more Terraria. Uh, and throughout the week, we'll be posting some other videos. So should be fun. So stay tuned. Hope you all have an amazing rest of your day. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye!